In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make the magic circle which can be used when you are crocheting in the round. So it could be something like a sunburst granny square or even a cuddly toy where you're trying to make the head of the toy. Um, either way, once you get it, it's really quite easy to use. So what you want to do to start is take the loose end of your yarn and place it over your fingers like so. And you might just want to use your thumb just to hold that into place. You then take the working end of your yarn and wrap it around your fingers and again I'm going to use my little finger to hold that in place. So you have an X on the front of your hand but on the back of your hand you have two straight lines of yarn. You want to take your hook and place it underneath the first thread and pull through the second thread like so. You then want to twist your hook and grab the same piece of yarn and lift up your hook just to create a little space and pull through that thread. You want to place your finger on the hook and just gently pull out your fingers out of the circle and that is quite simply your magic circle. So all that you have left to do now is chain however many um, chains is being instructed to do so. I'm going to chain three to get up to the height of a treble stitch which is double in the US and then I'm going to do a few treble stitches into that center circle and as you are working along you want to make sure that you are working around this thread here. You can pull on this thread just to make the circle smaller which makes it easier to work into as you're putting your stitches. I'm just going to turn off the camera and do some more stitches and I shall show you how to connect it up at the end. So now I've finished all my stitches and I'm left with what looks like a rainbow but we want to turn this into a circle. So I'm just going to hold on to my work with uh, these fingers of my crochet hook and what you want to do is take this end thread and gently pull and you'll see that this will start to close up nicely and you can really get a nice tight circle here so you have hardly any gap at all um, in the centre. Now all that's left to do is connect from one side to the other so you want to insert your hook into the top of the chain, yarn over, pull through, pull through the other yarn over and pull through to tie off and then you can snip off your yarn and there you have your circle. So there you are, I really hope this helps. Thank you so much for watching, I shall see you again next time. Bye!